At the end of the day, I've never seen a fucking capitalist trying to build a fucking raft out of shitty, broken fucking tires to swim across <laughs> shark infested water to make their way to Florida to fucking escape. Okay. What's up to all my free thinkers out there? The godless commies over at YouTube decide to demonetize the channel and start deleting videos without giving me a reason. I can't imagine why. So if you want to catch me live, I'm streaming Monday through Friday, 4 to 6 p.m. Eastern time over on Rumble. I also do some gaming streams on a different channel over there. So if you want to see me or you want to support me or you want to connect on social media, all links are in the link tree below. And all announcements will be made in the Freethinkers Rebellion Discord server. So make sure that you join up there. All right, back to the video. So I have never watched anything uh, fat electrician but I was told in the in the chat in the Discord you have to look at fat electrician. So somebody sent uh, it looks like some kind of clips. It says unsubscribe clips. So uh, if this is good, I'll leave a link below where you guys can go check out these guys. This fat electrician. Um, but the t title is the fat electrician hates communism. I kind of already love it. I had uh, Armando from Cuba come and my biggest video, my biggest long form video is a survivor of communist Cuba reaction to Tom McDonald's, the system, which is like just one of the greatest videos. I got the American flag robe today in the freedom freight shout out. And this is on, yeah, it's called unsubscribe clip. <laughs> Bro. The I've people you're in the last 48 with. hours of my life <laughs> just raging communism simps because <laughs> Donald, we just Trump, haven't done it right Donald yet. Trump had that fucking comment about how like, oh, Russia beat the Nazis and now it's it's weird because like Donald Trump right, but like communist sympathizers left and now all the communist sympathizers are like, yes, Russia beat the Nazis by themselves and I'm just shitting on all of them and it's I, I can't handle being on X. I'm going to get canceled if I go on there and have to argue uh, with these fucking people. What is it? As you're saying, it is this quick history lesson. You're going to see. Yes, Russia threw a fuck ton of bodies and helped stop I, the war machine that was did not help? Germany. Yes, but if your claim to fame is we had the most people die, that's a really <laughs> shitty stat. I'm sorry. Like, <laughs> it must have been done. Yeah. If I was in the NBA finals and... LeBron dunked on me the most amount of times, and I was like, I deserve to be MVP because I gave up the most points. No, no, Damn. no. That's fucking God. stupid. No. Did no. you know about oh, the shit. NBA? That's impressive. It, it's more like League of Legends or Call of Duty, like Warzone. It is mm. you and your three buddies are at the top, and that fourth person on that team has a KD of point zero zero six. He's died 80 times. Bro. I got one kill. He's like, then, this is my fucking you war. You get all these fucking dudes that simp over. Oh, the... <laughs> Did you know the USSR actually manufactured more tanks in America during World War II? Oh, did that. they? Did they really? You're scared. Really interesting. That's cool. Yeah. Who who did who did uh, who who did America send to the Soviet Union in I don't know like fucking 1929 and started their entire industrial revolution when he founded the Stalingrad tractor factory? Who? Oh, it was uh, Albert Kahn, aka the architect of fucking Detroit. Literally, America started your entire manufacturing capability. You're going to sit here and try to flex on me like that's a fucking <laughs> big big W for communism. How much fucking money did America give to the Soviet Union in the early years of World War II? Like, what, fucking, what $11 billion? You're like, oh, that's, that's, not, a lot. That that's not a lot of money. It's like fucking $246 billion-ish. <laughs> what's fucking, what's, a, what's Russia's military budget right now? I don't $86 know. Billion? I don't Oh, know. you gave them three times the annual military no. fucking budget, and you're going to come to me and be like, oh, communism's the fucking best yeah when it's funded by fucking capitalism sure it is oh why the fuck wouldn't it be hell yeah okay the same oh. reason you hear everybody like no did you, did you know that fucking cuba has the best healthcare system in Dude. the fucking world and the only reason that cuba isn't a communist fucking paradise is because america put an embargo on them and refused to do business on them yeah maybe but explain to me in logical fucking reasoning why it is that a communist fucking utopia can't exist because capitalism isn't going to work with them. It can't exist on its own. They need capitalists to fucking work with them for them to fucking survive, okay? At the end of the day, I've never seen a fucking capitalist trying to build a fucking raft out of shitty, broken fucking tires to swim across <laughs> shark-infested water to make their way to Florida to fucking escape, okay? Get over it.
Communism Dude. fucking sucks. You're never going to convince me otherwise. You're fucking wrong. If you think that the USSR single-handedly beat the Nazis in World War II, you're fucking wrong, objectively speaking. I can't fucking help you. I okay? love that they're, they're drunk, too. Absolutely. I'm happy to admit that they contributed to beating the Nazis. If you think they did it on their own, it's because you're breathing through your mouth and you're objectively fucking retarded. Those are the only fucking reasons that you would think that, okay? Furthermore, the only reason that World War II even fucking happened is because the Nazis and the USSR had an agreement that they were going to go ahead. They're like, oh, go ahead, invade <laughs> Fucking Poland, yep. and we're gonna have separate spheres of influence, and then we're not gonna fight, and then the Nazis attack the USSR anyways, and then they join mm -hmm. the fucking Allies. Okay, so the USSR is the reason that World War II even fucking happened. You don't get to claim credit for being yep. the only ones that fucking won. Okay, shut the. F okay. Also, uh, this was put into an article because after Hitler had the meeting with Stalin's people or Stalin, I don't remember if he talked to him, but after they made that agreement, hey. Hitler said, I'm going to invade Poland. You can't attack me. And then in exchange, I'll give you this portion of Poland. So uh, after Hitler did go and invade Poland, apparently what the part that he gave to the, to the Soviets, they came over and they implemented communist tactics in that part of Poland. And basically they had to find people that they called the irredeemables. So it was anyone who was like educated, anyone that they deemed a threat to com to their communist, you know, state authority, whatever garbage. And they killed them all. So they had a mass fucking grave over there. And then Hitler, while he was like pushing through into their part of Poland at this point, found the mass grave, and then he told all his people back in Germany, hey, we're the good guys. Look at these Soviets mass killing all of these, uh, these poor innocent people that didn't do nothing. And guess what? Churchill and, uh, was that Roosevelt? Churchill and Roosevelt at the time, uh, they decided, uh, we're just going to say that Hitler did it. We're going to say that Hitler did it because it is inconvenient for our narrative to tell people that the Russians, the communists, were also bad guys. So since there's two sets of bad guys, we've allied with one of the bad guys. We're going to lie on behalf of our bad guy to the whole world to help justify staying in this fight. Okay? So... Fucking crazy. Patton. Okay, it was Patton. Eisenhower. Eisenhower, Patton, um, and Churchill. Whatever. So, but it was that group. And so, yes, as he's saying, the, the communist Russians back then losing the most people and then acting like they won World War II is pretty fucking, it's crazy. The whole thing's crazy. All right fuck up i can't fucking handle it like i got two sons and then people are like oh you do jujitsu you're a big fucking tough manly man you are what if what if your kids grew up what if one of them was gay i don't care at all they can be gay all they want it's not going to bother me at all but if my child grows up to simp over the ussr or the german <laughs> military i'm going to consider myself a fucking failure as a father because my kids objectively fucking retarded okay yeah that's not acceptable to me i fuck I also have two sons and feel the same way. Uh, I feel like if he was gay, he probably got groomed, though. So I'd feel like kind of a failure in that way. Uh, but definitely don't come at me with communism. I can hate it. Dude, going to college with you must be a fucking nightmare. <laughs> no, try being a fucking hold up. Hold up. Sorry. Uh, I got the historian in the chat, Darmac. The Molotov-Ribbentrop Pact was the name of their agreement. Yes, Churchill and Roosevelt hid the massacre in the Kalin Forest, which is what you were referring to. Thank you. I appreciate that. We know things around here. Master, your teacher, your teacher's like, this is college algebra. <laughs> we just yeah. asked you to help us with the problem. So this is art 101? <laughs> Bro, Everyone in your class is like this? 
<laughs> you guys should see the fucking diatribes that Nick writes. And he sends us <laughs> of he our arguing with, <laughs> like arguing with college kids. <laughs> Dude, he bullies. Co- that is your. That's your Twitter. <laughs> yeah, you do in person yeah. Twitter. You do in IR, Twitter and IRL. Like, oh my god. Oh my god. You, like, what's the last battle you've been in on your your college frontier? It was that actually. Somebody was like, actually. You know, the, the Soviet Union manufactured more fucking tanks, and it was me just going off. Like, actually, the only reason they could manufacture tanks is because America sent their best fucking engineers to the USSR to teach them how to manufacture tanks. Furthermore, your tanks are shit. Also, America gave you, like, 4,000 fucking Sherman <laughs> tanks and 400,000 trucks. Did you know that in 1945, over fucking three quarters of all the vehicles that the USSR military had were fucking manufactured by America? Go fuck yourself. If you're going to sit here and be like, communism's better because they can manufacture more shit. Only because America's funding you, okay? The only reason that you motherfuckers were running proxy wars in Afghanistan in the 80s and 90s were because America taught you how to do it because we did it to you in World War II. Go fuck yourself. Communism sucks. Jesus Christ. Just some kid like this just being like... <laughs> just 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 fucking. What was the response? Oh, I, get it. I get it. Oh. What was the response? That wasn't real communism. Oh, fuck. I'm sorry. Okay. Every problem you have is capitalism. That's not real capitalism. Yeah. Go fuck yourself. Get out of here. We just haven't done it Jesus right yet. Cr- we- yeah, exactly. Look at you. Wait, we're like one more. What the fuck, bro? Like, fucking one, two, maybe three. Three tops. Three more genocides, and we're going to hammer out this whole cam- communism <laughs> idea. Okay, look. Communism is fucking stupid. Communism is perfect on paper. Okay, it's the, it's the greatest it's the greatest way to live that's ever been devised. The problem with having a perfect work of art is you're trying to apply it to an imperfect canvas, and that is humans. Humans are greedy, arrogant, stupid assholes. Everybody is at some point during the day. It's that's just fair. a matter of how often you are that person. Everybody's a stupid, arrogant, greedy. This is why fucking roundabouts don't work, right? <laughs> roundabouts are basically right? communism, right? They're the <laughs> communism of road structures, okay? Are they better on paper? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Except for Janet is in a fucking minivan trying to hand co- little Tommy <laughs> potatoes while she's trying to take a fucking roundabout at 65 miles an hour and it doesn't fucking work, okay? Gets the redistribution of Payment. Humans are dumb and you have to take it into account when you're trying to build a civilization. I'm sorry, but that's just the way it works. God, I love you, Nick. I oh. fucking hate communism. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Commie, oh my commies? god! Yes, I love that. 100. That's a, sh- so that's a shirt. And people will that's stop. Shirt. And now I, I get it because people stop it. Like <laughs> you got people that go through. It. They're like, oh, no one's coming. I'll go. Oh, you got me with the roundabouts. Yield and they'll just stop. Just sit there, go, and, and you are right. It is the it's individual. It's perfect on paper, but people fuck it up. Yeah, it's exactly like uh, returning your fucking your cart, your shopping cart, back exactly. to the little fucking stall. Mm-hmm. You can't rely on everyone to do that. No, you cannot. And it gets that great internet video that one dude that throws. No, that. throws fucking stickers on people's cars, and, and they shit. get <gasps> so pissed. <laughs> He's still he's still out there, right? Isn't oh, he like yeah, doing that? Doing doing fighting content. a good fight, dude. He gets It'll be all right, so buddy. angry. And then you get fucking. Look at, look at, look at, and then you get fucking right Tucker right Carlson going to Russia, being like, "Oh, fucking Russian grocery stores are so great. They have you have to put ten rubles into the grocery cart, and then that incentivizes you to return the grocery cart back to where it was." Yeah, fucking America does that too. It's called Aldi. Yeah, yeah Aldi invented it in West Germany in 1940, fucking <laughs> six, right after World War II. Yeah, we we do that too. That was intensely satisfying. That was really great. I love how much he hates communism. The fat electrician hates communism. Featuring donut operator, unsubscribe podcast clips. That's what this channel is. Uh, I'm subscribing right now and I'll throw a like and I'm going to copy this original link and I will put this in our show right now so you guys can see it. He said, yeah, those are the Demolition Ranch buddies. Okay. All right. Yeah, I haven't watched. I haven't watched them. 